In this video, how I created my perfect standing desk, how almost involuntarily a new product was born. But first, my name is Matteo and I have a small apology to make. Five years ago, I suggested that you should stitch together a few IKEA pieces and create a makeshift standing desk. And actually, I've used this rig for quite a long time. Quite unhappily, I must admit. Now it's time to move on. It's time to introduce Integral. Integral is a sit-stand desk that is made of solid wood. And this is why we're also in a wood workshop. Wood has been instrumental in the process of creation and design of this desk. I've been not alone in this journey. I've worked with my friend Adrian, who is a brilliant artist and at the same time a very, very skilled woodworker. We started from the need of a surface, a beautiful surface to work on. And we started researching what it would mean if we went to a completely natural material. Slab of wood that is as close as the wood was when it was growing as a tree. And the solution has been to find that wood through research and for some reason I found myself really attracted to uh, Lebanese cedar wood but this could have been uh, pine or any other type, uh, type of wood because what really counts here is the process and the process has been one of melding together my fondness for productivity and life hacks and Adrian's artistic and woodworking vision. And these two things together have brought us in front of this beautiful object. Now, Integral is made of wood that is treated the least possible. So it's just oiled on the surface. There is no varnish, there is no lacquer. And you can feel it when you touch it. And I wish I could convey to you uh, not only the feeling of touching, but actually the smell that comes from this natural sort of wood. Now, you can imagine that wood is a sort of panacea, but obviously it has to encounter design. And this is why, by using some ancient woodworking uh, wisdom, uh, this desk is made of five longitudinal pieces that are bookended by these uh, vertical slabs that act uh, also to block the wood from growing. This is a natural material. It will try to change slightly shape with time and through this technique we are sure that this will look as it is for the longest period of time. In the same way this will interact with the environment around it. Uh, it will change slightly color in the areas that will be more exposed to sunlight. It will live a life together with me. But in order to be a functional desk it needs to do some boring stuff too like take care of my cable management. This is why I have a power strip uh, just below my computer. There are three holes, five centimeters in diameter, that um, deal with uh, bringing the power from below to above. One of the solutions that um, we found while researching the problem of charging devices, and who doesn't have that issue, is that we would need a temporary solution Obviously, in the future, we'll have wireless charging, but um, we still have wires. And in order to have the neatest possible array uh, with wires, uh, we slotted a USB charger from UR cover right into one of the, uh, of the five uh, centimeter in diameter slots. To have the devices neatly on the desk, we also built this functional dock. That was not enough. Obviously, in order to work productively, you need your cup of tea or coffee. And this is why we needed coasters. We didn't want to stain uh, the desk with, uh, with a coffee. And the end result is this beautiful, symmetric design uh, that is coming from the scraps that otherwise would have been thrown away from, uh, from the wood of the desk. The same happens when we talk about uh, these beautiful pencil holders. You can actually follow the grain of the wood from the end of the desk all the way to these uh, beautifully designed objects. Just a marvel to look at and a pleasure to work at. 
But then we arrive at um, the reality of working at the desk, which is having your computer set up for standing. And for this, we went for a, a commercially available um, stand uh, in aluminum that allows you to have your monitor uh, at eye level, uh, separate keyboard and trackpad in order to have uh, the hands at the right level. And this setup is beautifully following you if you're standing and even if you have the need to sit for a moment, you can keep exactly the same setup throughout your day. Now, all of this is made possible by our attention to the details, our attention to nature, but also by a, a leg system, a commercial leg system that is called Jarvis, that allows this desk to go as high as 126 centimeters and as low as 60 centimeters from the ground. For my desk, we needed this size, 146 uh, centimeters wide, 71 deep, and then we have two different widths. In the, in the thickest part, we have three and a half, and in the thinnest, um, 2.7. Your measure may vary. In fact, let's talk about your desk for a second. Right now, you can talk with us and start ordering your integral desk. We look forward to have a conversation with you, starting from the URL that is appearing here, and it's in the description below, where you start talking about your requirements. We don't know yet what is the right type of wood for you. We don't know what is the right size uh, for a desk. We don't know what kind of overall solution we will come, with, come up with, uh, what kind of design changes we will make for you. What we know is that we're working on a lot of beautiful accessories like this one. So check the website to know where we stand in terms of, uh, of accessories. What we know is that we're starting an adventure, uh, putting together design and technology, putting together um, nature with productivity, and we're really excited about Integral and the path forward uh, with this uh, new project. If you want to support us, let us know what you think. Um, click the link on the, uh, on the description below um, to start talking to us about your requirements and get yourself an integral desk. It has made me happier and more productive, literally, and I think it can do that for you as well. Thank you so much for watching.